Hello, my name is Martin Wallebohr. Today I want to present the results of my diploma thesis, which I did at the Institute for Media Technology at the Technical University of Ilmenau. Together with our partners Casio and Stereotech, I implemented a view synthesis. So, what is a view synthesis? Here you see a camera setup with two real cameras. We can get the depth of the scene by analyzing the two real images. Out of that information we then generate virtual views or so-called in-between images. These virtual camera positions lie on the baseline between the two real cameras and if you compute enough virtual views we can simulate a camera movement from one camera to another camera. Instead of two cameras I put six cameras on a precisely adjustable camera rig from Stereotech. We took one shot from a fast movement and synthesized a circular camera movement of about 35 degrees. We call this method Frozen Reality 2.0, which is based on the Frozen Reality standard from Stereotech. Casio provided us with the Exilim F1, a high-speed camera, which can do 60 frames per second at a resolution of 6 megapixels. It was really difficult to align all the six cameras on one even baseline. For that reason, I developed a new kind of multi-view rectification, which is based on a paper from Richard Hartley. But let's see how the view synthesis looks like. At first we did only a single shot with a baseline distance of about 10 cm. Secondly, we enhanced the baseline distance to 50 cm and switched on the high-speed mode of the cams. The result is a nice camera turn around the two scene objects. There are some mistakes in the computation which originates from inconsistent disparity maps. But the closer you put the cameras together, the better the image quality gets. That was a rough overview over the results of my diploma thesis. I hope you enjoyed it and if you want to have more information or if you want to do some more research on the project, don't hesitate to contact me or the Institute for Media Technology. Thanks for watching.